welcome to today. Today is Thursday and I want to apologize to you guys. All right, so why are we sorry, Sophie? Um, because we didn't post a video. Gabby, why did we not post a video yesterday? Because mom didn't post a video. <laughs> you don't even know why, but you know it's mom's fault, right? Yeah. <laughs> so yesterday, Sam and I had to go to a meeting. It was a meeting that was unexpected. It just popped up and we had to go and it took a long time. By the time we got home late in the afternoon, it was rainy and dark and dreary. And so we decided to just skip a day. Yeah, we decided to skip a day. <laughs> safe to say it's been years since we didn't post a video. I think it's been years. How long do you think it's been since we posted a video? Since we didn't post a video? Stella died. No, we even posted videos when Stella died. They were short, but we posted videos. I don't know. Yeah. Anyway, we are back with another video and we are planning a couple fun things to do with you guys. Because we missed yesterday, we decided that we're gonna do a live video, but it's gonna be between now and the end of the weekend. Um, and I have a really fun live video to do with you guys. So I will post it on Instagram when it's gonna happen. I'll post it on Instagram before it happens so you guys all know to come onto YouTube and we're gonna play a game together, a horse game together. It's gonna be really fun. You guys won't wanna miss that. So to make it up to you, we're gonna do that with you guys. You got the you got the mail, did you? Yeah, because I saw someone drive. You saw the mail. So we are expecting a lot of things. Are you expecting something to come in because you ordered me something for Mother's Day? No. <laughs> did you order me something for Mother's no, Day? No, I wanted to get um you know what I drink? So I wanted to get you this cup where like when you put hot water in it or things in it, um it shows a picture of the picture you put in it. Um but it was too expensive. I didn't have $29. You don't have $29? No. Sophie, you gotta stop spending money. Mm -hmm. Holy heck. I That's okay. Don't worry about spending money on me because I have other plans, you guys. Like, you know, some mothers might be about what they can get on Mother's Day, but not me. I'm about what I can get my family to do for me. I have projects planned. I'll go get you something. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we are back and we're excited to be here and we're excited to have you here with us. What'd she find? She's scared. So you guys know, I've been telling you guys lately about how Daisy's having problems lately. She just hops and holes. One day she got shocked by the electric fence and now she refuses to go to the barn the normal way. Like she won't go down. She just lays there and looks at us. She's terrified. And here's the problem. Dalmatians are really active dogs, just like Border Collies. Molly! Dalmatians are really active dogs, just like Border Collies. And our main source of exercise for our dogs is going down to the barn twice a day. And then when it's warmer, we do more. We go like to the back field or we do, we do other things. But we really need them to like go down in the morning, go down at night and really run and burn off energy. But she won't go down now. I was gonna say, what do you guys recommend? But then when we came out today, Molly decided to lead Daisy on a merry goose chase and she took her down the other way to the barn and it seemed to fix the problem. But she's still terrified of the electric It's fence. like there's a ghost down there ready it's to It's like there's a head ghost. Off. She like, when she was running up, she was looking behind her. Like she, <laughs> she did not understand <laughs> that the fence is what shocked her or how it happened or how to prevent it. She doesn't, it only ever happened once. Molly got shocked a lot of times before she figured out it was the fence. Molly bit the fence. <laughs> Molly bit the fence. She ran into it with her mouth. But Daisy, 
feels like somebody just did something really bad to her and she wasn't expecting it. And she looked around and there was no people. She like was screaming, you guys. She ran back She's to a me. bit of a chicken. But anyway, that's our problem. That's what we're working on right now. Um, we brought the dogs out to this field here to let them run a little bit to burn off energy before we go to the boys. She finds a way that she could hurt her. I know. <laughs> Sophie, you are way overprotective mother. On that. It's a rock. It's some rocks. A bunch of sharp objects. <laughs> I'll probably buy you some bubble wrap and we'll just bubble wrap her. <laughs> and she'll be fine. <laughs> They look tired to me. <laughs> they look ready for a nap. I was never ready for a nap. Help me. <laughs> <laughs> she she doesn't let go. This dog does not let go. Until you open her mouth. Whoa! <laughs> let go, let go. <laughs> oh. Pickle, pickle. Whoa! That was worth mine. Went further. Give it. Give it to me, Molly. Give it to me. See these blinds? Mother's Day, they're gonna be hung up. And this, my friends, is why we go for runs. Why I take them to the field. They're also hot. So the other funny thing that I wanted to tell you guys about Daisy, I spend the most time with Daisy because Gabby keeps, like, everywhere, Everywhere Gabby goes, Molly goes with her. Like, uh, we hardly ever see Molly. If Gabby's in the bathroom, Molly's in the bathroom. If Gabby's in her room, Molly's in her room. Like, we, we barely see Molly. But anyway, every single morning, Daisy jumps on my bed and I can't be, and I can't be on my phone. I can't be doing anything that takes attention away from her. So, um, sometimes she jumps on my bed and flops down on me, just like, flops on top of me. That's how much she wants to be close to you. She's a super affectionate dog and I love that. But sometimes I just want her off me and when you push her off of you, she becomes like this dead weight and you can't get her off. Like, so I finally decided to fight back because I think we need to band together, Sophie and I. She pushed me off the bed almost. <laughs> how is that fair? So uh, basically I decided to fight back in the exact same way. So when she was laying on my bed, just minding her own business, enjoying her own life, I just flopped on top of her. <laughs> Scream. The first time I did it, she was so upset and she like kicked me off and was so devastated. And then the second time I did it, she screamed. <laughs> she screamed at the top of her lungs. Like, not because she was hurt, but because she's so shocked that I would just lay on top of her. I was being very gentle. Way more gentle than I, she I, I is to me. What? I got a butt in the face. Yeah, like she's not a very. That's how someone came, came up with the name butt face. Yeah, she's an interesting dog. That's for sure. All right, let's go. The queen has the queen has come. The queen is ready. So today we're going on a trail ride. Like, did you see if the arena is kind of dry? Actually, the arena is kind of dry. That's crazy. Uh, but we decided on a trail ride, so that's what we're gonna do. You guys know how I plan to do trails with Penny this summer, and now I can't. Well, I want to still do it with the girls. And Sophie, 100%, needs more practice with trails, so that's what oh, we're doing. She, she denies it to, to up until the minute we go. She's like, I don't do trails. Do you wish you brought your boots now? Uh, no, I'm good. Anyway, it's 13 degrees, Gabby is here. There she is. <laughs> She's got her shoes on, I've got my shoes on. We're both trying to figure out the best way. Anyway, it's 13 degrees today, not super cold, so we have to take off our horse's blankets. 
and I forgot to bring treats. Shoot. We're actually in a hurry today and Storm's taken off. I took one look at us and said goodbye. All I want to do is take off his blanket. I don't know if you guys can see, but see that purple thing running down there? Yeah, that's the horse I meant to take his blanket off. You okay? What's the matter? Oh my gosh. What's the matter? What? Why are you empty handed? Oh. I'm beginning to think that they recognize our car now. Uh oh. <laughs> Oh my gosh. So Gabby got Storm's blanket off and now Storm is telling them to run. Storm Look, Finn's him. almost as tall as Storm. Finn is not almost as tall as Storm. Here, let me just check you. You got scratch marks. Should we take that off? Yeah. Oh, does it feel good? I took it off, all your hair. All right. So I want to make sure you're okay. I'd like to check you. Yeah. You're okay, handsome. You got your blanket off. Okay? Alright, now they're gonna beat me back to the barn because that's what they do. Unfortunately said that I was a fake day by day vlogs. Yeah, people always tell Sophie, you're not the real day by day vlogs. If you are oh, no, only on the one person. Everyone else is grateful. Everyone else is grateful. So they found my TikTok. On TikTok, people have been telling Sophie that she's not the real uh, Sophie. If you're the real Sophie, post a picture of Finn. But she's like, my whole account is all Finn. <laughs> and at the barn. All right. So anyways, we are getting ready to go for our trail. Then he's still shedding out. Hi, handsome. You guys, I can't tell you how excited and happy I am about this boy. Yeah, I figured it out. Some... There's been some change in him, like a massive change the last couple of months. You wanna see how easy he moves over? Yeah, let's see how easy this he moves over. This is one of my flexes, because I did not train him to do this. Okay, this is a flex. His old owner trained him. All right, his old owner trained him good. Yeah, all right. Beautiful! I know. <laughs> with Finn, it does not work. No, with no other horse, it doesn't work probably. Yeah. Good boy! Anyways, um. So there's been a big change. I don't know if you guys have seen him move weird differently. For big horses to actually acknowledge your existence. Yeah, big horses don't usually acknowledge you, which is kind of fun, though. She says. Um, this oh, is she's how I my Okay, hold on here. So, anyways, like I keep on telling you guys, there's like a big change in this boy. There's a huge change picking off his scabs, and I'm oh, trying to figure out what it is. It happened after he had that cellulitis. And I'm just trying to like, was it the medicine we gave him? What was it? I am 150% sure it was the farrier. We got the new farrier came the couple days after he had the cellulitis. Yeah, farrier, cellulitis, same time. And he just gets better and better and better after every far farrier visit. This so. is how I hold my saddle. My arm's just resting. Fancy. Thanks for sharing that, Soph. We were really worried and wondering, we were really wondering about how you carry your saddle. And it's so true, like, farrier work is the most important thing. Like, if you don't have good feet, then you don't have a good horse. It's just, it's, it amazes me how a farrier can make such a difference in a horse. And the farrier that works so good for Chino might not work so good for another horse. Like, it's okay, just, you back away. okay, get away from my horse, she says. This is, how I carry my saddle. this is how Gab carries her saddle. She carries it on her hip. Tell me in the comments below, how the heck do you carry your saddle, you guys? I carry it with two hands, one under the pommel and one under the cantle, and I huff and puff, ah, 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 because it's so heavy for me. All right, there goes one. I have my trusted husband here, and he is going to drive me on this trail ride. Yeah, I'm driving. So the girls can go on their own. They're doing really well. They do better. Sophie does better without me. She does better with just Gabby because Gabby's not a nervous person. And to be honest, I would have no qualms with Gabby going out with her friends and just going on their own. But with Sophie here, she's still a little bit young for me, and I like to keep her safe. She gets her overprotectiveness from me. All right, we are home. We are home from our little walk. Finn's sweaty. Finn's sweaty. 
Chino sweaty. How'd you do, Sophie? Did you feel brave? No. I didn't, we didn't show you guys, but on the way home, Gabby did not pony Sophie. Do you think you could do it again? No. <laughs> I didn't have to pony her on the way there. I was holding my arm back there because Finn couldn't keep up and get the fucking back there. This is a game that we play. We play tug of war. <laughs> just like, just like Daisy. Yeah. There's anything that he can chew, he will chew it. Total boy. Yeah. Total boy. He chews his reins. He's like, let me chew it. All right, let's go. We are ready to go home. This boy will just back up. Him, it's really hard to back him up for some reason. He'd do great with our natural horsemanship course. Natural Liberty. We are home from riding and you guys remember I tried to get a cell phone a couple weeks a couple months ago. I wanted like a fancy I wanted a fancy one and it was and there it was really hard to get. And so I kind of just put it off after it was hard to get and then I still need one. So finally a couple days ago I ordered one. Um I was super excited. It's supposed to be here any day and literally 20 minutes after we left to go to the barn it arrived like it, the second we left to go to the barn it arrived so yeah they have the worst timing so uh, then we had to rush to the post office to pick it up we got the little thing in the mail we went to the post office office to pick it up and we got there at 4 p.m exactly and the guy was walking out of the store close so i've been missing my phone this whole entire day by seconds seconds you guys all right what are we gonna have for supper i'm making coolers oh we're gonna do that thing We'll do it tomorrow. You guys, do we have a video for you? No, TikTok Ruby. video. I'm making cool aid slushies. Do we have chicken wings? Oh, wait, we have chicken nice. wings. We have lots of chicken wings, sister. Lots of chicken wings. When all you can do is buy groceries, you buy a lot of groceries. No, so. where are they? They're in there. Um, Listen, in Gabby, for your channel, I was thinking you should do a uh, Ttiktok trying weird TikToks. Yeah, How much yeah that'll be I so add. fun. Chicken wings, Dad. We cook chicken wings. Sam's the chicken, chicken wing cooker. Well, I don't know. Mom says we do. We do. They're frozen though? Yeah, they're frozen. Look at the freezer. Frozen. Anyway, that is it for today's video. I apologize again for missing you guys yesterday. It doesn't happen very often. And when it does, I miss you guys. I feel a disconnect. Last night when Sam and I were not editing, we're like, what should we do with ourselves? And of course, the one day that we don't edit, the internet went out. So we could have watched TV, we could have played video games, like we could have done whatever we wanted. The internet was out for the whole entire night. It was you just a disaster. Video games? Well, I don't play video games, but anyway, it was a disaster. Everybody's starving. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Don't you know that you're beautiful?